Howdy folks, um, time for something a little bit different. A man bag? A purse? No. Coin purse? Mm -mm. This is a miniature time machine. And inside, two miniature time travelers. I know. Weird. Let's talk about it. Inside the uh, little coin purse, two time travelers. We have an American and we have a Brit. British Penny and American. So if we uh, think about time, time is kind of interesting. Time uh, can mean an infinite line goes on forever, no ending or beginning. I think of time more uh, malleable, more like liquid, like a river or stream that's continually flowing. If you had magic, you could tap into it. I know that sounds kind of crazy. The two coins, if I uh, take them out, can demonstrate the power of the time stream. The two coins. Um, name one. The American. Watch the American close. If I wave the Brit over the American, he slips a half second out of time sink. If we take the Brit just a second later, it also slips into the time stream. Of course, if you reach out, it's very difficult to catch anything inside and out of the time stream. There it is. Got it. It was the Brit. Of course, if this is the Brit, the American's still in the time stream, but if you wait a half a sec, they switch places. Now the American's out and the Brit's in, but a half second later, they switch again. All it takes is a moment. Watch close. Just like that. The, the American in the time stream, or excuse me, out of the time stream, the Brit in. If I touch the coin, you can see that the American and the Brit almost magically move in and out of the time stream. There is a problem manipulating time, and that's time itself. Because all you do is uh, wait a moment too long, and they slip. They slip backwards to the beginning. Not of time, mind you, but to the beginning when they were back inside the little time machine, the two time travelers. That's the American and the Brit. Thank you very much. See you next time.